president someday? First, you have to pass fifth grade social studies. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Today I will do more than I have to do. I will treat others as I want to be treated, and I will try to become a better person. Hey, China Spring Intermediate, this message is for our 4th and our 6th graders. Every year, 4th and 6th grade gets to go to the fall production. 5th graders, you don't get to go this year because you go to the symphony, and that's just too many students to take. So, we'll be going on November 13th. This is just for 4th and just for 6th graders. If you could please, um, from now until then, bring in $2, deliver it to Miss Husky. We'll mark your name off the list, and that helps go towards funding the fundraiser for putting on the fall production. So teachers, it's off your plate. We'll collect the money and students, we're going November 13th. We'll make sure that we let your parents know. We'll put it in the CSI happenings. But if you could bring the $2 in and Ms. Husky will mark your name off, we would appreciate it. Thanks. Okay, Chad Spring Intermediate. I am gonna go over a couple of rules that we need to tighten up on. That's my job. Not always a fun part of my job, but here we go. Two rules, rule number one. In the mornings, you must make it down to tutorials when the 7.30 tutorial bell rings. We're going to start closing off the hallway with this yellow chain and this authorized personnel only sign. If you see this stretched across this hallway, you are not welcome to go down the hallway. Tutorials are closed at that point. If you need to come into the office, you are welcome to come into the office and ask questions. Also, you are welcome to go to the library if you have a blue library pass. You've got to make sure that you are getting to tutorials at the appropriate time when that tutorial bell rings. If you need to get here earlier, talk to your parents because all the bus riders are here early enough. That's something that you need to discuss with your families and you need to eat breakfast earlier too if you need to be down the hallway at 7.30. Make sure you're taking care of that. Rule number two, we want you to drink water. A hydrated brain is a learning brain, but we're having people bring in Shipley's cups and cups without lids and cups with lids like this. Well, this spills if it tips over. So what we're asking is that you start bringing your water and things with appropriate lids, especially as it gets chilly. We know sometimes we try to sneak in the hot chocolate or the cappuccinos. That's not okay because then they spill on our floors and they get things sticky. We want you to drink water, but it's got to be in a container that has a lid. Thank you very much. Monday for lunch, we're having grilled chili lime chicken with cilantro lime rice. All right, guys, so your trivia question this week, we're spotlighting a teacher again. And your question for this week is, which teacher's favorite theme park is Disney World? And how many times has that teacher been there? All right, I look forward to hearing your answers. Don't forget your food for food for families. Winner gets a pizza party.